Welcome everyone. Thank you for joining us once again at Finance Magnate's Executive Interviews. We're here joined by Sherwan, Head of Business Development at FXGT. Thank you, Sherwan, for meeting with us at the IFX Expo Limassol. Thank you very much for taking the time to meet me today as well. So tell me a little bit about FXGT. What's the story behind it? Where was the origin of it? How did it start? All right. So uh, we're a CFD broker. Uh, we've been around since 2019. It's more started from a very small office of three people with an idea to create basically a broker where we can offer a variety of assets for people to trade in. And uh, over the past five years, we managed to grow to a company of over 280 employees, uh, multi-licensed um, global broker. Mm -hmm. So yeah. You mentioned multi-license, so you have different jurisdictions, different regulations. Absolutely. So we have an FSA license, we have an FSCA license, and we also have a Vanuatu and a CISOP license, but those are more mainly for institutional. Okay. Yeah. And what's the challenge in that? Uh, challenge? Uh, I wouldn't say there are challenges, basically. If anything, being a multi-license broker uh, it gives our clients the sense of security they need that, you know, whether they're, they're trading with trading either either trading or partnered up with a broker that's transparent and reliable and will always be, always be fair to them and i mean let's be honest there is hundreds of brokers yeah, out there absolutely. so what what is fxgt offering different to your clients what are the different features that you can offer yeah, right. to them so basically well, we sat down and thought about it what does a client really need to trade with a broker they need security transparency and something that uh fulfills their trading needs. So what we did, we created a trading environment that provides everything. So uh, when it comes to trading the specifications, we have multiple account types. Right now we have four account types, which serves all of our clients' needs. So we have our beginners, we have our intermediate traders, and we have our professional traders. So we have created a product that can serve all of these clients. At the same time, as I said, we provide them with transparency and safety through our regulations and licenses. And of course, one of the most important thing is fast deposits and withdrawals for the clients. So technically speaking, we have created one of the best trading environments out there for our clients. And what are some of the trading tools that you can offer them? All right. So we focus a lot on providing with our, our traders with cut, cutting edge technology. So uh, recently we launched uh, a set of MT5 trading tools, which they can help uh, our clients with their trading, whether it's for risk management, uh, chart, uh, chart analysis. Uh, we also um, have a huge educational part on our website that clients can go through and they learn everything that has to do with trading A to Z. Uh, we have dedicated analysts that will shoot out emails to our clients on a weekly basis about any major economical events, how it will affect the market. So basically providing a full educational package to all of our traders. Do you have uh, any of these features embedded into an app or something of the sort that the traders can use? Actually, we, we have not we have not said this to anyone yet. Uh, we have been secretly working oh, on an app, exclusive. so it's an exclusive for you guys. So yes, right now we are working on an FXGT app. It should be out within the next three to four months. Uh, we're developing it in-house, so it's all us. So yes, uh, soon enough we'll have that as well. Great. And any of these features that you were mentioning, like the educational tools, the news part, all of these, are you going to be offering it within the app to the traders so they can engage with this? Uh... Of course, we currently offer it on our website as well, but it will be integrated within the app as well. And that makes, uh, we were just speaking actually earlier today about community growth and engagement with the trading community. Mm -hmm. And there is this trend that we actually see yeah. uh, from Finance Magnets and Forex Live that there is more and more brokers nowadays integrating different tools within their platforms to help the community to become more engaged and stay up to date so they don't actually have to leave the broker mm. to engage into the trading and Absolutely. all of these systems. Absolutely. Having these tools is a must for your traders yeah. nowadays. Yeah. One of the things we were discussing as well actually is the fact that you know nowadays the trading community is looking at engaging with each other they're looking mm -hmm. for the the human connection mm -hmm. and feeling the belonging etc etc how is your customer support and your relationship with your clients in this uh, environment that's a great question we take customer support very very seriously we take our client satisfaction very seriously so uh we have a 24 7 support team multilingual any language you can think about they're there uh, any time of the day, you reach out to our live support. So either through live chat, tickets or emails, someone will always be there to help you. So we're always in contact with our traders at any given point of system. 
Mm -hmm. And I mean, AI has been a big part of the discussions at CIFX and in many other events that mm -hmm. we have been around and, and in our community where we see finance magnets mm -hmm. and for I we see it constantly being brought up. Mm -hmm. Um, what kind of trends do you foresee as FXGT in the industry and, and in the trading community in general? If we're, we're talking about AI, of course, AI, we see it. In general, in AI is one that I have mm -hmm. particularly noticed because everybody's talking about it. But if you have any others that you have, uh, that would be great. Well, trends in the market, I mean, I couldn't agree with more with you. Everything is moving toward AI and technology. So if anything, I believe that, that that's the to go to trend right now, technology and AI. Mm -hmm. And for FXGT in particular, is there any, what's the foreseeable future? What, what is the direction that you guys are going into? I mean, you right. just mentioned the trading right. app, so. Yes. Right, so we have, we have a lot of things in plan actually, but the trading app is one of it. So uh, we have a lot of things in the pipeline. I'll mention some, some I will not. Uh, so we are also working right now on uh, our web trader. Mm -hmm. It's something that we're also developing on our own. Mm -hmm. It's going to be, also launched within the next three, four months. We're also working on our copy trading slash social trading platform as well. That of course will be somewhere Q1, 225. So we have a lot of things in the pipeline. We're continuously developing. We're continuously looking for ways to, to provide the best trading experience to our traders that we can. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So one of the trends that actually we have noticed throughout the past year or so, it's a lot of the AI that we were mentioning the AI, mm -hmm. right? But it, as a tool to gather data from clients in order to make better decisions for your business. Mm -hmm. How are you currently utilizing any tools that you have? How are you utilizing the feedback that you get from your clients in order to improve your services? Well, it, that's one of the most important things for us because as I mentioned earlier, our client satisfaction is, is very, very important to us as a business. And a lot of our decision making is based on our clients' feedback. So we regularly send out emails to all of our clients with survey questions to see what they have to say, what, what they would like us to improve, what they would like us to change. We do it through our social media platforms. We actually have a dedicated, a dedicated team that their job is to see what's been written about us on social media, the negative before the positive. We gather all of those and we change whatever we can on the spot. And the things that we do not, we cannot change on the spot for technical reasons or for technology reasons, we put it in the pipeline and we definitely work on. So. Any feedback we get from our clients is taken very seriously, always taken into perspective, and we base a lot of our decisions on that. How is the client sharing the feedback with you? Is it through, through an account manager? Is it through a ticketing system? Mm -hmm. How, how well, do you do it? We, we usually do, uh, we do it through our marketing department. So we will send out emails with a set of questions asking the clients, for example, what would you like us to change about this trading account? Uh, this uh, asset pair, would you like us to add any new asset pairs? So questions like these, and based on the answers, we take actions and develop the product to our clients' likings. And in terms of partners, I mean, we didn't touch on partnerships mm -hmm. yet, but maybe you can explain to me a little bit how you work with partners mm -hmm. and how you gather feedback from them and mm -hmm. how does that impact your business? Uh, we, we are very, very close with our partners uh, to the point where most of our partners with their business development managers or with the companies, they have developed friendships. So uh, we, a lot of our business is in Asia, so you will see us most of the time in Asia seeing our partners face to face because we believe in, in human interaction. So we're always close to them, listening to them, what they would like us to help them with. In addition to that, we offer a very, very lucrative uh, partnership uh, package. So we offer some of the highest rebates, we offer CTAs, revenue shares, whatever the partner likes. But of course, it's not always about the money. So uh, our partners, they, they need tools to better understand their business, to better uh, increase their business. So we provide them through our partner uh, portal with uh, a lot of tools, set of reports that help that help our partners to understand their business, where it's strong, where the weaknesses are. And of course, we are always there to support our partners with anything they need in order to help them increase their business as well. So we're, we're very, very close with our partners. Uh, every now and again, we'll bring all of them to Cyprus to come to the office, meet us face to face. And over time, it has proven that it's the best ways to work with your partners, so treat them as partners, actual partners, not as only introducers of business. Mm -hmm. Makes a lot of sense, yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, Andrea. With us and a nice discussion. It's been great having you at the Pleasure talking to you as well. Thank you very See much. See you at the next one. Thank you.